I promise to keep today's video short, but I wanted to talk about outsourcing. It's something that is so hard for people to do, I think, when they first get started. I am outsourcing part of my Christmas this year. Here's what I'm outsourcing. Take a picture here. Look at that. I am outsourcing the cookies. When my kids were little and I, I made it an event, we baked and we made cookies and you know, just had fun with it. Well, now it's just my husband and I, and it's not fun anymore, but I wanted some pretty cookies. So I thought I'm going to outsource it. I just ran to the local grocery store and picked up some cookies. And it made me start thinking about outsourcing in our life in general. I remember growing up, my parents were raised during the depression. So they have that mindset that you do everything yourself. You save everything. And that's a whole nother topic, saving everything. But we had to, we did everything ourselves. I know how to paint. I know how to mow. I know how to build things. I know how to, um, craft wise. I know how to crochet. I knit and macrame, you name it because every Thing that we did, we did ourselves. We would go to a craft show and my mom would go, well, we can make that ourselves. You know, everything. And that's just the way I was brought up. So even when I started working, oh, I can do that. I can do three jobs at once. That, that was just my mindset. I had to do everything. So fast track here to my business with affiliate marketing. And there's a lot of aspects to do. And my mindset in the beginning was I can do it all myself. Well, I started learning. You're not going to grow very fast if you do everything yourself. My husband and I flipped a house about three years ago. The first one, we did everything ourselves. Now, was it rewarding? Absolutely. It was rewarding to know that we could do everything ourselves. But oh my gosh, it took a year and a half. It took forever. And we didn't make a lot based on the time that we spent. And once we sat and did the math, so we had to say, we, well, we made some money and it was fun. Well, do you want a hobby or do you want a business? That was a hobby. To be honest, if we continue, we need to hire people. That's what we learned. We've got to hire people, not because we can't do it, not because we're in, incompetent, but because we want it to go faster. And that's what you have to start looking at with your business. What can I have somebody else do so that I can focus over here? So maybe you're doing your own YouTube videos, but maybe you can get somebody else to post it. All that description that you have to write and um, all everything that goes into that, somebody else could do that for you. Or maybe you enjoy that. Well, what about your posting? Maybe you don't like to post on social media. You don't like taking that content and putting it where it needs to be. Hire somebody to do it. Maybe you started a Pinterest account. You love Pinterest, but you don't have the time to make it help it grow. Hire somebody to do it. Uh, your, your channel banner or your Facebook banner, you know, maybe you're not real creative in the graphics and everything, hire somebody to do it. So you call that outsourcing. Don't figure, don't always try to figure out how to do it, but ask yourself, who can I get to do it? So that's my goal for you going into 2020, figure it out. Who can I get instead of how can I do it? it, it because yes, you probably have lots of talents, but you don't have to. All right. So that's my gift to you. Get out there going into 2020 and start outsourcing. Just take a little bit at a time. It is such a relief. I actually have one of my granddaughters working for me. She does some things for me and she loves it. She's making extra money and it's even more rewarding because I can help her and teach her how to get into business. And she gets to earn a little bit of business uh, money on the side as well. And I'm outsourcing. I have her doing things that I don't need to be spending my time doing as well as other people, but there's my tip. Make sure you subscribe. I will see you on the next video and thank you for watching. And I would offer you a cookie. That's kind of hard to get through, but don't, don't be ashamed of outsourcing. It's a good thing.